Now, your first alert weather on KTVB.com. Did you see a little snow up on Bogus Basin this afternoon as the clouds started to pass? That's because the low pressure system and the cold front that came through during the night with all that wind lowered temperatures and snow levels. And we got some rain and at higher elevations above 6,000 feet, the snow stuck a little bit, but not here in the valley, even though there were some reports of some ice pellets or a little bit of light hail at times as this storm pushed on to the east and most of it is now to the east of us. The clouds are starting to wind down and we'll stick around for a while until the evening as the slow pressure trough pivots on eastward throughout the night. Then high pressure will return by tomorrow, but it certainly has cooled things down. Afternoon temperatures stayed in the 50s after being in the 80s yesterday, so it does certainly feel more like fall and it will for the next couple of days, even though we'll get back to some sunshine. Look for some patchy frost and some patchy fog in the morning and then sunshine the rest of the day. Morning temperatures throughout the Treasure Valley will dip into the mid to upper 30s tonight, so cover your gardens if there's some things you want to save. It will be up to 65 degrees tomorrow, a little bit of a breeze in the afternoon. And then Thursday on through the end of the week, we warm back up into the 70s. Nighttime lows not quite as chilly. The weak system brings a few clouds on Saturday, then clears up. And through early next week, we're warming back up, but staying just a degree or two above average in the upper 70s. We may not see any more 80s for the rest of the year.